people of YouTube. This is Jordan here from um, Oahu, Hawaii. I'm here in Starbucks right now and doing my third monthly report, I mean a second monthly report. So um, I traveled to Oahu on November 21st. I've been here for, let's see, two, um, somewhere around 17 to 18 days. And I've been tenting outside pretty much every day. Um, I found this really sick place to tent. It's actually illegal in Hawaii, but uh, who cares? As as long as the, as the police don't find you, it's fine. Um, I have met some new people, primarily on couch surfing, but I found out that I needed to meet people who will travel with me long term in order you know, because I want someone to shoot my videos. And um, I want a group of friends who can travel along with me, just like um, High on Life, that YouTube channel. I don't, really, I don't know if you guys have heard of it, but uh, I really like that channel in there. And there's a couple of other travel travel videos that's really that's really awesome. Um, so I just really want to find a cameraman who shoots my video. Um, other than that, I already hired two freelancers on Upwork and they are professional video editors that will edit my videos for somewhere around $30 per video so and their quality is pretty good so that's pretty worth it about the money part it hasn't been going so great because I've been using my parents' money my initial plan was the first time uh, just when I came here I would rent a place to stay long term or rent a place to stay long term but now um, it's that's not the case because um, I, if I want to rent a room since I'm Canadian it's really difficult to rent a room I don't have an employer uh, who hired me over two months I don't have sufficient income um, I have a job but it's buying bitcoins and people don't really trust that people it's not like a common job like Oh, this guy is an engineer, or like this guy is a uh, he works at Safeway, or he's like a manager uh, for transportation or something. It's buying bitcoins. People don't really trust that. My employer is in Germany, so people don't really have contact information about my employer other than his address. And I'm, I'm Canadian. If I want to rent a room in the United States, that's kind of difficult. So renting a room, that's not going so far, uh, too good so far. But I've already contacted this this place, and then hopefully they'll rent me, me the room for uh, pretty soon. Um, I found a job at a surf store. Um, it's kind of under the table kind of deal. They only pay me ten dollars per hour. But the reason why I work there is because. They offer tours. Yeah, like, there were people who was talking over there. Okay, so they, they offer tours, um, such as shark shark cage, helicopter tour, um, like all, all of that good stuff. So if I work for them, I will get those tours for 40% um, off, I think which is really worth it, worth it. and then I'll, I'm gonna go on all of them. I might also even, I might even buy a skateboard from them. So, so yeah, that, that's why I decided to work there. Um, other than that, there hasn't been a lot, lot that's going on. Over the past few days, I've just had a few banking issues, um, just try to resolve some problem with my bank. So yeah, um, that, that is a monthly update. Am I on track for the one million dollar by the end of the year? Though um, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. Judging from my current uh, current circumstance, um, I think that uh, I will focus on the travel vlog and the Airbnb business for now. Um, what I will do, of course, I will still um, buy and sell stocks. What I'm thinking is that I'll try to learn everything before next year and then um, 
before then I'll create a hedge fund and then when I go back to school I'll try to see if I can start like study and then do the hedge fund at the same time I'll take 10 credits initially and then I'll see if I if that will work out okay so since I got my so since I got to Hawaii I haven't really been listening to personal development material that much. I haven't been reading a lot of books. Um, I haven't been following through on the Udemy course. I mean, what I spent my time on, I surfed um, a couple times, eight or nine times, which was pretty good. Um, but the thing is, what I didn't like about it is that I, um, instead of, I brought a stove here and I expect that I could, could cook, but the thing is, the American gas wasn't compatible with my stove, so I couldn't cook. And I've just been buying pre-made meals from 7-Eleven, pretty much, in this bakery. Um, and a lot of the stuff that they sell are kind of unhealthy, so I've been eating unhealthy food for a while, in which I didn't really like. I, I mean, I did, did not enjoy it. I, I don't like unhealthy food. I, lo I love healthy food, um, but if you don't have any money here in Oahu, you don't have a lot of choice, and you don't have a kitchen, you don't have a place to cook, you're tenting outside, you don't have much choice. Let me just tell you my experience at Wahoo so far. Um, just when I got off the airplane, a man, like on, on the second day, the first day I didn't sleep, the second day I was at Starbucks and um, I met this 59 years old, um, half Afro-American, half uh, na Native Indian dude. He, uh, he was in the military and then he was he was in the military, and he is a really nice guy, so he showed me around. It turns out that he was homeless as well, and then he showed me the place that he was tenting, which no one would, would bother me, because there are a lot of homeless people in Oahu, like a, a lot of like bad homeless people who's, who do drugs, and um, like these people, they want to steal your stuff in order to get some drugs. But, but this nice, nice person, he showed me around and he showed me to this place that I can tent and, and that's where I lived for the past um, few weeks pretty much. Yeah, I'm grateful. But except for that... Okay, so that's about it. Um, that was my November um, to December monthly goal report and I just hired two freelancers uh, that will edit my videos um, so from now on the videos will be edited by a professional so I hope I'll get much higher quality for that and yeah I'll see you guys next time um, Aloha